Good morning, Councilman Grove. Good morning, Councilman Salters. And good, good morning, morning Vincent. More energy, please. Yes. Okay. <laughs> we got. We got our first guest, Roxy Salters, aka Smooshy, aka Moosh. Um, gosh, she's gorgeous, and she's all mine. Um, I think she kind of looks like her daddy. <laughs> Uh, it's another great way to week here in Vincent. We had, uh, I got busy, uh, so we had to push the video to Tuesday morning, but that's what happens, and there was a lot of rain, and our set's outside, so yeah, kind of makes things a little bit difficult. What a difference a week <laughs> makes, though, right? Last week we were in snow. Wow. And freezing. I was still in shorts, so yeah. that's positive, but a lot of great things. We want to go over pothole control. We want to go over our parks, and I got a special segment specifically for Councilman Grove that's going to come up every week, and he doesn't even know what it's about, but I'm so excited about it. I'm excited too, and I don't even know what it is. All right, so Pothole Patrol, uh, as you notice, we've had a lot of freezing and thawing, but right now it's getting a little bit better. Cooler this week, but still great to be outside. Uh, and, and the key thing that you remember, we're going to see potholes. So we need you to report those potholes. Our street department does a fantastic job yep. of getting out there and fixing those potholes. We'll put the they will below. respond. They yes. will respond. That's yes. the quickest way to get to us. Yes. Uh, and, and if you don't know how to get to us, let us know and we'll fill out the form for yeah. you because it's a piece of cake. Um, it takes less time to do the pothole patrol than it does to make a Facebook post. I promise. Bingo. <laughs> That's good stuff. Uh, just keep us informed so we can get that up. Our street department does a great job. Uh, a lot of the stuff's dried out now too, so they can get in there and get those. They've been yep. out all last week and this week. Uh, they'll be out getting those. So if you see a pothole, say something about a pothole. Let us know yes. and we'll get to it. Uh, and also with weather warming up, we, we couldn't you know, not remind you about all of our awesome parks that we have. Yes. So Councilman Grove, go for it. Name all of our parks. Oh, what parks can you enjoy? Uh, okay, Riverwalk. That counts. Yes, it does. Yes. Riverwalk Lester, what? Leicester Square. Yes, and there's another section of Leicester Square. The fitness park in Leicester Square, but that's okay. We'll let um, go. Yeah. Next. Uh, fitness and, yeah, never mind. <laughs> and let's see, Great Park, of course. Woo -woo. Chicago Park. Bingo. Four Lakes. That's got a splash pad, but it's too cold for it right now. Yeah. No, you're good. Uh, and, and, and he's, got, yeah, he's, got, he's got parks there. And don't forget Kimball. Um, obviously, he's taking over that one, but it's a fantastic park to go to. And if you're, it's always popular. Yeah, right? very popular. Yeah. Very popular look at it. If you're out and about, and it's one of the nice days, the sun's out, uh, I know it'll be a little cool this week, but go out and enjoy our parks. Uh, take your pooches. Take your kids. Yep. Uh, enjoy going out there. I'm trying to teach her to get on a leash, obviously. Yeah, I'm not doing a very good job, but we're working on it. Um, and always remember to pick up after your kids. I mean pets. <laughs> Maybe my kids I'm going to pick up after, but I don't know about anybody else. Yeah. Uh, so enjoy our parks. It's one of the, I, I, they're the gems of the city. I mean, there's so many great things to do in our parks. Uh, this brings us now to my new favorite segment. I, it's going to be my favorite segment for a while is how many days until food trucks? And yeah. <laughs> We'll do this every week until the until we start, and then once it starts, Council Grove will give us a rundown of who's going to be at the food trucks. Yeah. Uh, because surprisingly, that's one of the biggest questions every one of us will get, and there's only one of us that's the godfather of food trucks, and that's here yeah. right next to me. So, how many days until food trucks? I don't know days. Got it. We're looking, so next next we're time. looking <laughs> at mid April, first of May at the latest, um, depending on Mother Nature. You know where at. Uh, definitely the river walk. Okay. It will be at the river walk. Uh, we do have to get permission for that. Aunt Tent will be coming to uh, the board of work soon. Um, uh, I wonder if they'll say no. I, I, I doubt <laughs> it. I doubt it. They've I, been super with the. Uh, I know a guy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but we are excited. We already have new trucks interested, so um, there's going to be more variety, uh, more trucks, and. Uh, yeah, we can't wait. Yeah, I, I mean, it's one of the uh, one of the really neat new things that we have to offer yeah. here in the community. Uh, one of the biggest complaints was shade. I'm going to address that. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So we go had for it. we had a, a business Barmas Construction step up last year, and uh, before COVID, and this was uh, early January, they called and said, "Hey, we want to provide shade for the Riverwalk," and uh, they bought enough. Uh, Umbrellas for every table that we own. So every table will have umbrellas sponsored by Mom's Construction, and uh, 
We, we love them. I, we, can't, we can't wait to use them. We're, we're all looking forward to food trucks coming back, especially back on the River Walk where it started. Yeah. Um, it's just a great event. I mean, at its peak, you know, you got you know a couple thousand people that will come in and out yeah. uh, and just enjoy being together. Uh, the nice thing about it, obviously, in the day and age of COVID, we've got plenty of space to space out in the River Walk. You're outside, which is one of the safest places to be. I'm really looking forward to it because that kind of kicks off. Uh, I don't want to say minor events, but that's one of those things that we get used to to be able to do to be outside. I know when we see things like the farmers market and things like that start to pop up, so uh, we're really excited about that. We can't wait. Hopefully, we'll get like, a specific date so that we do the countdown that we actually time. have the date. Yeah. Right now, it seems a little vague. Someone <laughs> seems to be getting political with this. Yeah. All right. So, other than that, uh, we hope you have a great day. Hope you have a great week. We look forward to seeing you next week because it's another great day. Yes. Have a good one.